Bernardo Circus is a unique Broadway-style circus performance that's been touring in the U.S. since 2014. Yeah, and tonight the cast will celebrate a decade of dreams under the big top with a magical, exhilarating, and all-new experience for guests. Lauren Kelly is in Sugarland this afternoon with a sneak peek of what's to come <laughs> from opening night. Are you juggling yet, Lauren? What are you doing? And you got no, I am not juggling just yet. I have a long way to go before I start juggling. But I'm here with Kevin Bernardos. You're giggling, I though. love this. I love the feel under this big top. I love uh, this circus so much. And I am you. so glad that you are back here in Sugarland. Tonight to is the opening night. We're a little bit excited. So for our viewers who have not been to the Bernardo Circus yet, tell them about it. Bernardo's is the little circus that could. If you passed out there along, what is that, 59? You got it. Yes. You're going to see a magical, let's see, look, a very little tent. Uh, it's intimate in here. It seats about 500 people. Uh, and what that means is that you are right next to the artists. Yes. Who are above your head or it's not like you're just watching the show. You're a part of it, which uh, that's one of the things that people really react when they see this. This is a group of people from all around the world. We together, we put up the tent. We together uh, do the show and all the tasks associated with it. We all take it down. We move down to the road together. This is a company that has been bootstrapped. Uh, this is actually our 10th year. 2024 is marks 10 years, a decade of dreams. Congratulations. Uh, thank you so much. That's I awesome. was living out of my car uh, 10 years ago. And you got into the circus. And, uh, well, I, funny, I'd, life is not always a straight line. I'd been in the circus, and, uh, and I just I didn't have uh, a lot of personal self-discipline. But uh, fortunately, life has a way of teaching you all these yep. amazing lessons that you need to learn. And uh, I love the circus, and I love the people that make it. So uh, for some reason, obviously, when you're down and out, the only thing you could possibly do that makes sense is to start your own circus. <laughs> <laughs> and, and that's what I did. It started out as a tiny little event yeah. at a fair and a dusty lot. And all these 10 years later, we travel 43 weeks of the year. We visit 20 Amazing. some odd cities. And we're touching the hearts of hundreds of thousands of people all across the country. I love that you chose and Houston, Texas and Sugar Land to kick it off. Yes. This is a special circus Sugar because, Land. yes. We make cotton candy. It's <laughs> oh, you, you do, because yes. I saw the truck outside that says yes. candy on it. Yes, it does. So I do want to tell people, like, this is a Broadway style circus. Yes. You even have musical numbers. There is a lot. Look an edge over here. That you guys are There are see a giant musical numbers that start uh, and end the show. There's crazy people like Edge who's in the frame right now. Hey, we, hold on. I really would like to. You have a space for, for me to come in and work. Here. We can't do I this I was segment. actually, is there any chance that you have a red sparkly? Uh, oh, hold on a second. Uh, What's this over here? Uh, Edge. Would you slide, how convenient. slide into that That is thing? just so convenient. And oh. it fits. Oh, like this a is glove. Remarkable. Oh, my God. Yes. Okay, now wanna, we are ready say to. The, uh, I don't know, say ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Bernardo. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Bernardo Circus. And now I'm going to steal your hat oh, away. Give me that hat back. <laughs> Thank you. No, but there is so much fun for everybody when you say all ages. It's, you it is for all ages. Yeah. You can actually take a date to this show. It's sophisticated and quality enough that you really feel a satisfying experience. Thrilling. Uh, yeah. But you can also take the kids. You can go with the family. It's yeah. a very diverse crowd that comes to see our shows. A lot of folks who come to the circus here have never seen a circus before. Actually, that describes a lot of America. Yeah. Uh, because circus, there's so many different options out there for entertainment now. Can we just I'm, kind of address the elephant in the room here? He is balancing a ladder on his mouth. I know. We mouth. don't actually have any elephants here. Uh, but <laughs> That, that is Edge. <laughs> this is his plate spinning act. He does. Uh, he's lots part of a of cast fun of extraordinary entertainment. People. Absolutely. Aerialist, acrobats, lots and lots of comedy, an intimate, amazing experience where there's popcorn, cotton candy, uh, dancers, thrills, chills. And uh, you can have a really wonderful time. Here I'm not giving him top. my nice China wear to put on his plate spinning <laughs> act, that's for sure. Even though I definitely trust Ed and all of his moves. Kevin, what's your favorite part of the circus? Him, what's your favorite part? Honestly, I get to, I still am the ringmaster after yeah. all these years. But my favorite part is stepping to the side. And I get to see there's a th three different generations of uh, people. Yeah. Uh, you know, <laughs> there was no circus here before. Yeah. And now we, this little team, decided that we wanted to make it happen. And, yeah. and so here we are, three generations of people enjoying this experience uh, in different ways, but doing it at the same time. There's not a lot of uh, entertainment forms uh, that really exist right. and that can boast that kind of acclaim. Well, you guys are here through March 3rd. Congratulations on everything. If you guys <laughs> want you. tickets, all you have to do is log on to the website. It's Bernardo Circus. Com. Easy as pie. Find them on Instagram. And I can't wait. I've got a bunch of nieces and nephews and a husband that are going to want to be sitting front row for this. But I might have to just like are be you right for, here. For a job? It's just, she has wonderful With energy. My sparkly she? jacket. Derek and Tessa know that I would leave for the circus. <laughs>
You would totally fit <laughs> in. We are it's completely inspired. Look at Derek, dazzling Derek. He has a sparkling jacket on too, Lauren. You can't see him. Look, he's balancing paper. Yes. How's he fell? Yes. I didn't have a ladder. He Amazing. fell. Okay, Lauren, we're gonna check back in so with you. Flashy. That was fantastic. Okay. Okay, coming up. Gear, get over. Welcome back to Houston Life. Looking for something fun to do this weekend? Okay, grab the fam for a grand old time and head out to Bernardo Circus. Yeah, Lauren Kelly loves this spot. She says it is a magical experience. It's all kicking off tonight in Sugarland. And Lauren, uh, thanks for the sneak peek today. Some pretty incredible acrobatics we've seen. You guys are so welcome. I'm just so honored to be here, and I think that I got the color coordination note. The red is definitely a running theme under the red and white big top here. We are at Crown Festival Park, and this circus runs through March 3rd. You've got plenty of time to come and see it. Tenth year opens tonight, and tickets are online right now. I'm going to put a link up. I'll give you all the details in one second. But we've been chatting with Edge, who's been just an awesome performer. But we've got Angel here with us. I want to talk about this being your first actual show, but you've been in the circus for how many generations now? So I'm actually a fifth generation circus performer, so that means that my great-great-grandfather was uh, started the circus tradition in my family. Um, I've been doing little shows here and there, but I've never been in such a professional show as this one, so this is going to be my first live performance starting tonight. I'm so excited for you. I don't want to ask it, but are you nervous? Um, a little bit. It's not the same practicing every day as performing for hundreds of people, but you learn to control it. Of course, everyone's ever, always going to be a little bit nervous, but you, it gets now, better with time. I have a question, Angel. Did your great grandfather, your grandfather, your father, did they all perform the same act? No. So actually, uh, we've performed all sorts of acts. Uh, my grandmothers, my aunts, uh, my family's normally a uh, flying trapeze artists. So my, my father was a trapeze artist, my, great, uh, my grandfather was a trapeze artist, my great-grandfather was a trapeze artist, but we've done all sorts of things. And this now is you're speaking my language. What is this contraption called behind us? Because I saw you set it up. It looks like a small tripod, but it clearly opens up to something way bigger. So this is actually an original concept by uh, my mentor. He created this apparatus and he uh, passed it over to me. It's a hand balancing table that stacks up and up and up until it almost hits the truss at the top of the tent. You gave me a little bit of a sneak peek. You said eventually your foot does touch the top of the tent. Yes, it does. Uh, luckily, we're a little bit behind, <laughs> but yes, it gets really, really close. And how many hours do you have to practice to do something like this? Because we saw you just kind of balancing and you have incredible, you have to have incredible core strength, upper body strength. Yeah, um, so I've been training since I was four, year old, four years old with my mother, um, and we've trained for hours upon hours for years, obviously. Yeah. I'm 19 now since I started since I was four, and not a day goes by where I don't practice or I at least do something. And like, another fun tidbit, your mom does your costume? Yes, she does. She makes our costumes. She makes a lot of the other performers' costumes. As a matter of fact, my mother is also a performer. So awesome. So. That's so great. That's so great. Okay, well, we're going to let you get ready because I want to see how this works. What did you tell me it's called again? It's a hand balancing table. Hand ba I mean, easy as pie. It's pretty much what it is, what it looks like. Okay, so I'm going to have you go ahead and get ready. Edge, I want you to come on over here. I'm right First here. of all, you have been so much fun helping us get ready today. How long have you been with this circus? I have been with this circus for about three years now. So uh, I've been to Houston. This is my third visit here to the Houston area, and uh, I'm excited to see each and every one of you guys how get long, out How here. long does it take you to bedazzle your suspenders? Bedazzle my dis it depends can on you, can you make me some? If it depends on if I'm doing the sew or the glue, okay? E6000 really does take a beating, <laughs> but you want to get in there with a needle if you want this yeah, stuff to last. We're course. touring, okay? I didn't think this conversation was going no. this way. Okay, so as Angel's getting ready, I want people to know that we are at Crown Festival Park. It's we right down 59 off of the Crab River Road exit. You can't miss it. The big red and white top is out there. Now, I think that you need to help Angel get ready for this He's performance. Got one more piece of equipment that he he needs to have handed. Why okay. don't you just, I'll take oh, your okay. job, you take my job, okay? I'm gonna, okay? I'm gonna put that Go ahead, you put that down. Is I'm gonna heavy? do this. It's a little bit heavy, oh, little bit, but oh you got God. it. Okay. You got it, it's all right. Here just get go. it to him, he needs it. Okay. My practice. Here okay. you go. All right, we're good You're now. You're gonna need that mic back. So, does this make you nervous watching him perform? Is Every this a dangerous act? Single time, <laughs> uh, without fail, I see every show. I've been working with this young man for over a year, and I've watched him develop this act. I watch how hard he works, and every day I am in 
impressed more and more and more. The fact and, that his balancing skills are out of this world is just jaw dropping alone. It's and that's just with his hands and his feet and it, he can do. It's just absolutely crazy. But this entire cast, every single person has some skill or maybe multiple skills that absolutely blow your mind. To have all of this talent under the big top in one place at one time. This is the no not to be missed family family experience. So get out here, get a ticket, get yeah. them fast. Yay! Yay! <laughs> can we all yeah. can we all just do this? Well, I want to just do this. Can we all just take a bow? Ready? Yes. Thank you, Houston. Oh. Thank you. I did nothing but Edge and Angel. You did fantastic. HoustonLife.tv for all the information on the Bernardo Circus. Houston Life will be right back. See you at the big top.